Welcome to the overview of the Peterborough Town Library project. Approaching the library from Pine Street and turning onto Concord Street, you can immediately notice that the library is now at street level. You can see the activity happening inside and immediately relate to the building um, as a pedestrian on the street or even driving by in a vehicle. The historic front piece of the library, that building is 1892, will be completely preserved and restored. And the materials in that building are pulled through the design. So you see copper and brick and other materials like the granite stone pulled through the new wing. As you enter the library, to the right there's an elevator. Or you can take a left and go into this front porch area. And this front area is for social meetup space. It's a place you can feel comfortable having a cup of coffee, meeting up with friends, casually having a conversation. You could take the elevator up to the main floor where there's our public computers, or you could use those stairs. The adult collection will be located here. And now we're going to peek over and see that the young adult area is also in the in that front porch area. Our teens need their own space. They're not adults, they're not children, so they'll be located in that mid space and have their own autonomy and independence. As we enter into the historic part of the building, you can see that portico entrance and what's now the reference room will be totally restored. It'll look very similar to what it did in 1892 and be reserved for quiet reading workspace a place that folks can count on to be quiet and productive. Going back into the main building, you can see the architects have pointed to the historic structure and pulled that same sort of truss kind of theme throughout the building. There's a centralized information desk. And along the western side of the building are beautiful views out to the river. This space here is a community gallery and it leads into a large meeting room space that seats 120, has beautiful views out to the river, catering space in the back, um, tables and chairs, and it's available after hours. So we're looking forward to attracting new groups to Peterborough to use this as a small meeting place. We're going to back out of the building now and let's pretend you pulled into the parking lot, parked your vehicle, and now you're approaching on foot, entering what will probably be most of the time the main entrance for most visitors to the library. There's a nice waiting area for those that are waiting for mom or dad to pick up or a rainstorm to pass. And then you enter into the building. First thing you see is fully accessible elevator, which would be a huge improvement for our building. And then to the left we have a 30 person, very flexible space that can be used for technology classes, art classes, or early literacy. Entering into the children's area, you'll notice that all of the library shelving is at 45 inches or lower, so we have great sight lines throughout the area. And there's plenty of space for parents to learn and engage with their children, use the maker space, and really have another destination to be in. This is all on its own floor, it's safe and closed. Now we're going to pop outside. We're indicating a green space here. It could be used for outside programming. Perhaps a cocktail hour happens outside and then moves to the meeting room afterwards. And it has great views of the downtown and the Main Street Bridge. Thank you for watching. For more information, please visit peterboroughtownlibrary.org.